the 214 are part of the third batch of students that were flagged off to Israel by Vice President Edward Chionka Sekandi at MTN Arena last year. Training them in agriculture will improve their skills which will be practiced in Uganda when they come back after one year. To thank the Ambassador of Israel to East Africa for the continued support to Macau University. During the flagging of ceremony, the First Lady and the Minister of Education and Sports, Janet Kataham Seven, reminded these students of their responsibility at hand. My appeal to you is that you will raise the Ugandan flag high in Israel, as you heard the ambassador tell you. And how will you do this? Well, I have been informed that the students are actually hosted on various farms to receive hands-on training skills that exposes them to modern farming methods. Do your, work, do your work with excellence and integrity, and no one ignores an excellent and honest person. However, excellent work begins with a good attitude and the right mindset towards work. Our God has placed us on the earth to subdue it and have dominion. And the only way we... Also present at the ceremony was the Israel ambassador to East Africa. There are no miracles in agriculture. You know, only hard work. What we learn in Israel is no miracles. It's hard work and how to use technology. It's not miracles. It's not... Rocket science always already exists for many years, and I think you should be the champions of this change in this country. You should bring what you are learning in Israel. The government, our government, should help you with bringing the technology to, to Uganda. But there is no reason why this country will not flourish. You have the knowledge. Again, I think we all, you all, uh, uh, have to give yourself and to your colleagues. Round of applause for the number of seven out of nine uh, best students of Uganda. It's amazing. Isa Gaba, the coordinator of the program in East and Central Africa, underscored the importance of such programs to countries like Uganda, whose economies thrive on agriculture. These are agriculture students, so they are going to farms. To, to, to put into practice what they've been studying in their various uh, universities. This internship materialized after the government of Uganda signed a memorandum of understanding with Israel to help empower fresh agriculture students from Uganda get hands-on skills while on the farm. Joseph Bule, UBC.